Our shine for the day is the syncopated hook. Right? Yep. Yeah. And base it. One, two, three, five. Close that door. One and two and three and four, five, six, seven. One, two, three. So my left foot stays in front here. I go one and two and three and four. Tips for making staying fast and keeping up with the music. Small steps under your body, on your toes, right? So I have one and two and three and four. You can utilize the hips, ladies, and that will also help with the movement. I hook behind five. We talked about winding up here a little bit. You can also wrap here or bring the hands up high, like Danny had showed you earlier in the day. You want to show them the other option? And then six, seven to your right foot, and basic two, three. When you're turning, there's a couple ways to do it. You can either step through your turn, which is fine. So five, step six, step seven, to basic. Or you can do the entire turn on one foot. So it's five, so you turn on the five, and then come to one. That also may give you the option of doing two if you want to do that. Uh, and then, of course, if you're at a spot, it's always going to be nicer as well. Great, so uh, for our pattern today, we have sombrero. Sombrero, and one, two, three, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, five, six, seven, and one. We're going to start with a cross body lead. One, two, make sure you come out of the lane by three. Pull her across on five, six on seven, or six, seven, we're gonna start switching the hand, so we're right to right. We're gonna give open break with a tiny little step, and we're gonna open her a little bit to the outside here. Remember, tiny, tiny step, guys, two inches. One, two, three, we'll ask for the hand low here. She'll give us the hand as she turns. Five, it's a uh, cumbia here, six, Seven, and we're going to start going over on seven. If it goes over on eight, that's fine. We're going to bring the hand around, let go of both, and ask by one. You might get it closer to three, that's fine. Tiny little step here. It's hard to prep out because we don't have a lot of clearance here, so just keep it in front of her and stay close enough that the connection is strong. Five, turn her six, seven. Guys, turn, remember, turn out, face her, spot, two, three, and then notice that the connection here, uh, let me start the connection, it was here. Okay, so the connection stays the same with the hand, and then when I finish, I rotate the palm towards her again. I'm always within that hook of her hand. Let her come forward on five, turn her six, and seven. Guys, remember, on the first cross body leap, you need to pull with both hands on five, then do the switch. That was a really common mistake. So, one, two, three, Pull with both hands, then switch, and then the lady shouldn't have to think of anything, right? We shouldn't think, oh, we got a good handshake. No, it should be you guys making the transition, that silky smooth, and she knows where to go. Open break on one at an angle. He pushes at an angle to bring me through at an angle, right? So one, two, three, and then a lot of us, we're stopping the girl a little too early, right? So we want to go one, two, three. He's outside of his shoulder, so go a little farther than you think and ask for the hand clearly so that I can connect with you for my turns. Looping, guys, you, look, you felt good doing this. Remember, you have half a basic here before you move forward, though. Right, so this is one, two, three. Then she comes forward on five for her turn on six, seven. Ladies, for the styling, I'm coming up on one, two, three as he turns, and then I'm rotating the hand and finding the right ear as I turn it. So you're going to be underneath that arm. The saddle looks like this. Two, three, and if I don't turn, it's five, six, seven. That's it. Booyah! Alright, bring it in. 